So now we're really going to change gears on you. Right. Um, we're going to show you a late harvest dessert wine that we do. And uh, let me give you a little rinse here. And uh, our late harvest dessert wine is called uh, our Sydney Simeon. And Sydney is our other child. Um, and uh, she is now uh, uh, just about 16 years old. So she was very sweet when we started making this wine. <laughs> This is a sweet wine, and at 16, uh, I'm being a you little challenged on the her. sweetness side. You might yeah. have to change her to a different bridal. Exactly. So, fun thing about this wine, this is, a, again, a very different uh, uh, wine that you don't normally see right. in this area. It's 100% Semillon grape, and the Semillon grape comes uh, out of warmer territories. Um, it is uh, the base grape that's used in making Sauterne in France, uh, out of the Sauterne region, which is a sub-region in uh, the Bordeaux area um, and uh, they have a lot of heat there so in order for us to be able to produce this wine we go to eastern Washington to get the fruit oh, wow. we go to Clipson Vineyard and Clipson Vineyard is uh, just about 45 minutes west of Walla Walla mm -hmm. so it's out uh, it's out in a very hot and dry country yep. um, so what that allows us to do is hang this fruit very late in the year so this was actually picked on the 28th of November 2013 and by the time we pick uh, those grapes, the only thing left on the vines are the clusters of grapes. The leaves are all gone. So by the time we pick them, they're beginning to raisin and that concentrates the sugars. We also, in this particular location, do get what we call noble rot. And noble rot is a good thing. Uh, it's uh, caused by early morning moisture and afternoon heat. And what it is, it's a fungus that begins to grow on the grapes, and it too loves to suck the moisture out of those grapes. So it further concentrates the sugars, and wow. it gives us some really beautiful flavor. We slowly barrel ferment this in French oak, uh, and then this was aged for about 13 months in oak. Um, it's wonderful with a beautiful cheese plate. Oh, yeah. Or with creme brulee, oh, or with now you're talking. yeah, yeah. <laughs> far, uh, it's also good with foie gras. Uh, oh. One of my very big favorites, though, is at Thanksgiving or, or uh, at holiday time to have this mm. with uh, pumpkin pie or mm. pecan pie. So Ooh, that's delightful. Yeah, give that a try with the blue cheese. Have wow. a little blue, uh, and. Uh, what you'll find is, is that the combination of the pungence of that blue and the sweetness here uh, are absolutely beautiful. And that blue will melt in your mouth. Mm. What a delightful. Mm. That is so nice. That it nice? counteracts it perfectly. Exactly. It exactly. It's all perfect in my mouth. Exactly. What an education, what a fun place to come and wine taste. Absolutely. I really enjoy it. I love your little barn here. Yeah. The breakout rooms. I'm going to be uh, hanging out on your patio and drinking a glass of wine. Perfect.